Hey guys, what's up? It's Lidor. My name is Lidor. I'm from Israel and I want to talk with you about the elimination of the top Iranian terrorist, Qasem Soleimani. So, yesterday President Trump ordered to eliminate the terrorist and that's what happened. Now, I just uh, logged into CNN website and they're saying there will be a potential fallout, like there will be revenge and the US won't be able to deal with the, the, this fallout. And I listen to this and I say, what a load of crap. It's written by CNN, which is a leftist, liberal, uh, uh, weak uh, news site. Weak, which means weak people. Those leftists are weak physically and weak mentally. What does that mean? That means they are afraid of anything. They are afraid of Iran. Even though the US Army and the US country can kick their ass, can, can eliminate the, the entire nation, the, this entire world in a week with all its power, with the Air Force, with the Marines, with whatever. And so now what they're saying is, oh no, oh no, we are so afraid. That's what CNN and the leftist media are spreading to you, which is a load of crap. So don't fall to it. Well, I'm from Israel. So, we are strong and we need to be stronger. And we shouldn't be afraid of those terrorists. So, let me this, give you this metaphor. So, you're a big guy and there is this little guy that comes up to you and starts pushing you and starts uh, shoving you and punching you. And you can take out that guy with a single punch to put him down and you don't do it so this guy thinks he's strong even though he's not and because your mental state in your mental state you're weak and you think you're not strong so even though in reality you are strong you won't do anything you won't hit this little guy which is pretty stupid now you need to understand that the Iranians and Islam in general is, is not a peaceful ideology. There are numerous proofs of that with terror attacks. With, if you go and read the Quran, if you go, and I did research on, on it, and not research on Wikipedia, I did actual academic research. I've read articles, I've read books about it. People in the West don't understand the liberals, the liberal less leftist people. <clears throat> they don't understand that religion and that ideology and the culture in the Middle East. They don't know it. Now, of course, there are people that are good, you know, Muslim people that are good, good people, of course. But the ideology, the religion itself, its concept is violent and not bad. This religion didn't come to coexist with other religions. It came to dominate, which means to be the only religion. Anyway, so back to Qasem Soleimani. That I, I don't even want to mention his name, not to give him any honor. That's, that's the way you deal with terrorists. If you mention their name, it automatically gives them like a status. So let's call him that top Iranian terrorist that was eliminated by President Trump, by the US Army, by, by the nation of America, which is great. That guy, that terrorist, was responsible for a lot of terror attacks in Syria, in Iraq, against Israel, against us. So I'm happy 
to see him gone and I thank President Trump and what we should do now is be prepared and not be afraid we need to be American people and Western people we need to be in their head mentality in their mentality they need to be strong strong yes and that's it and let me know in the comments what you think be sure to subscribe and give a like if you like the content and i'll see you next time thank you